Hello guys, it is Shivam here. Today I will explain you how to connect the Android, iOS and web app through Firebase. So let's get started. So let's create the project first. Give your project name. So I am writing the connect app here. Click on continue. Again on continue. Now select and default account. Again on continue. So as you can see, Firebase is creating your project. So just wait for a few seconds. So it is done. Let's move to the Firebase and let's connect the iOS app first. So you can see we need the Apple bundle ID. So let's move to the Xcode and copy the bundle identifier from there. Go to the runner and click on the signing and capabilities. Copy the bundle identifier from here and Paste it on Apple Bundle ID. Click on Register App. Just wait for a few seconds. Now download the Google service info.plish file and we need to paste it on Xcode. And make sure that it should be Google service slash info.plish file. It shouldn't return anything rather than this. If anything is there, make sure you edit the file name as you can see on the screen so just paste below the info and click on finish so click on next next again on next and continue to the console so as you can see io setup is done so now connect the android app as you can see there is android package name so we need to move to the Android app build.gradle file and copy the application ID from here and paste it on Firebase. Now click on register app. Wait for a few seconds. And now download Google service.json file and we need to move that file in Android app folder as you can see on the screen. Now click on next and we need to copy the plugin on project build.gradle file. Now copy the above line and paste it here. Now edit the sum part as you can see on the screen. So remove apply false statement. and some of the inverted commas and brackets apply the semicolon remove the id yes it is done so now add the plugin and add to the app android app build.gradle file so just same copy the above line paste it here Edit the sum part Now we need to add some dependencies in the same folder Now just paste it here And second one also copy and paste it here So click on next and continue to the console So as you can see iOS and Android setup is done So now let's move to the web app as it is written app nickname so you can give any nickname you want so i'm writing connect app here click on register app so as you can see we need to add this key in our project so we need to add this key in our main.dat file but before that we need to add the firebase core package in our app to access the firebase through the app so just paste in postpackml file and use command s key 
to run the package just wait for a few seconds so as you can see it is done now let's move to main.dart file and add the few lines here So as you can see we have added some keys here so just copy that keys from firebase and paste it here so first we need the api key so we copy the api key from here and just paste it here now co copy the app id copy and paste it on app id section now message sender id copy and paste it here project id Now click on continue to the console. As you can see, we have successfully connected the Android iOS web app through the Firebase. So if you like the video, do like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.